I'm Lonnie Shambi, and with my partner, Stan Simpkins, we're the Small Business Virtual Roundtable. Today, we're doing another snippet of five minutes, and today we're doing another one of our insights into our peer-to-peer -peer advisory group. And, and what we're showing you is subjects that come up and how we handle them mm -hmm. and how the group handles them, more, to, more importantly. Today, the subject is timing. Timing's never right for decisions. They say timing is everything, Stan. Is that true? No, it's the only thing, Bonnie, <laughs> that we know. <laughs> well, pay attention to the stock market, looking at the price oh, of houses, look at the please. interest rates. Oh, God. We have the please. perfect plan. The only thing we don't have is the timing. We, we don't, Exactly. <laughs> and, and the thing is, this: if it wasn't for the right timing, I would have done this or that or fill in the blank. We all have are subject to timing and have missed the window off it. Why? Because yeah. they're not paying attention. Well, and that's the most important thing for timing. Pay attention. What's the environment that you're trying to work through? That's critical. Well, you know, Lonnie, in our in our meetings, we know that the five key areas are workforce issues, right. finance issues, marketing and sales issues management, leadership, management team issues, and systems and procedures. And yet, what's the common thread to all of those that seems to come up over and over again, which kind of is insidious and they don't realize it. it's the timing of it. You know, yep. It's like we got the right answer. We just don't know when to do it. Yeah, we don't know when to pull the trigger. That's the important thing. And <laughs> and it's it a lot of it has to do with the environment, internal and external. When I talk about environment here, it has everything to do with what's going on in your business and around your business. That's that was is the biggest thing that affects timing. And a very minor point, your resources. Well, on that issue, Lonnie, as we both know, one of the caveats at our meetings is is the members don't so much tell people what to do as to ask questions, questions. about the issue. And we know the answers are easy if you ask the right questions. Right. And that's really what takes place at the meeting, mostly. And they ask questions that sometimes make people uncomfortable. The interesting thing is when they throw something out and they talk about timing, the questions that ensue from that are, when did you last do this? Or when do you plan to make it happen? How are you going to make that? How are you going to make that all work? Those are questions that they ask each other. And it's it's amazing because what happens is people will come to this roundtable and they will say things that they would have never said before until this subject came up. Yeah. In fact, as I think about it, the feedback that members give each other on timing, which comes from experience, you, you know, you've got a real estate property manager in a group as a member who better to give someone that guidance when it comes to when should I build a buy a building or build a building or, you know, where can I get the best rates? I mean, it's just a lot of that, you know, because when pe people give you their business plan, the question they hate that we ask is when are you going to do that? Yeah, exactly. And, and see that the thing is, this, this is one of the things that, that the, that the, a peer to peer advisory group brings to all of this. And that is they will put the reality of the, of timing to it because they'll say well you can't do that and do this at the same time which one of those things is going to go away because they're very familiar with each other's business after a bit yeah that's just one of the things and, and how valuable is getting feedback on timing it could be everything i'm stan simpkins with my partner lonnie shami welcome you to one of our uh, guest uh, appearances at our roundtables, virtual roundtables, just go to www.sbvirtualroundtables.com and look for the little green box and click on it and ask for an invitation. Thanks.